The honor of Tree Farmer of the Year was bestowed in 2017 on Clifton Taylor and officially recognized at this forestry field day on the Taylor's Elk Cave Farm, which is in the Forkland community near the Boyle and Casey County line. The Taylor family manages the 1,200-acre forested farm, parts of which have been in their family for over 100 years. Clifton Taylor and his sons, Scott and Steve, managed the farm today, along with other family members. Clifton Taylor was recognized for improving timber production, creating better wildlife habitat, and recreational opportunities on the family farm. It's certainly a, a, a very rewarding activity to, to see, you know, our woods develop, see the timber develop over time, see, see wildlife here, see excellent water quality that comes out, and, and then to enjoy it at the same time. That's, that's very, very rewarding. The Taylors have done extensive work on their property, especially in the area of putting in a network of roads and trails so they can better manage and harvest the timber while providing recreational opportunities for the family. That includes using best management practices like installing environmentally friendly screen crossings to reduce erosion on forest roads and trails. So that network, um, as we've built it over time, it's again, it's, it's helped us to do management activities, to do forest and improvement. It's also helped us, you know, to do harvests. And, and, and then the, the other thing, it really helps us to get there and enjoy it and, and see it. Um, it it's really a, a very important piece of this. Clifton Taylor spent decades managing his property with the assistance of forestry, wildlife, and other natural resource professionals, all of whom considered his woodlands a great example of property management. You know, it's part of family pride, obviously. They have a relationship to the land like many of our farmers do. That's the same thing for woodland owners, and this is a good example of it. The Taylors provide high-quality hardwood timber for a variety of markets. They have recently sold white oak stave logs to an international buyer who is using their certified Kentucky white oak for its cask. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.